Tonight, families affected by last night's storms are working to repair and rebuild. Take the town of Church Point, for example. Darcy Ortiz spent some time there today and joins us live in studio with one family story. Darcy. Beverly Reese tells me she has been living in Church Point for more than 12 years. However, after the aftermath of Tuesday's storm, she's left with a brutal reality for her and her loved ones. It's just been overwhelming, but you know what? We're safe and that's what matters. Reeves says Tuesday's strong winds and heavy rain caused a significant amount of damage to her home. It was my husband that was by the table and uh, he just, it was so loud with the rain and stuff. He really couldn't hear anything and he just heard a bunch of boom and he said by the time he got out, it was over. It just happened that fast. Despite the unexpected damage, Reeve says she feels blessed that she, her family, and animals survived. We've had to tarp the top, and uh, my daughter, stepdaughter, lives next door, and um, half of her roof came off. Miles Carrier is Reeve's soon-to-be son-in-law. He says he wasn't expecting this, but says he's thankful his family is safe. I had some family and friends over last night. Uh, pregnant fiance wasn't feeling too good. She wanted some pizza. So we went to town, get her some medicine, grab her a bite to eat before the weather got too bad. Carrier says he got about a half a mile down the road when he could not see through his windshield. They started calling us concerned, wanting us to get off the road. We told them we were about five minutes away. We hung up with them, got about a quarter of a mile down the road, and when they called us back, they were all in the living room saying that all the windows were shattered out. There was glass everywhere, and it was raining inside the house. Carrier says his fiance is seven months pregnant with twin girls and hid in a closet with their four-year-old son while half of the roof ripped off of their home and glass was shattered everywhere. Fortunately, everyone is safe. Live in studio, Darcy Wertik, KTC TV3.